Oh, hello. This is Lisa Swank, and um, it's time for uh, my creative year uh, review or to share a product or a tip or technique. Um, and I've decided that I wanted to do my review on um, the Custom Keepers by Shannon Green. Um, as everybody knows in the group that I'm on Gina Aaron's design team, uh, but this is the first time that I've been able to uh, play around with Shannon's Custom Keepers. And if you're familiar, oops, let's go this way with Shannon Green and there's her information and you know I will link her uh, she's got a, a video on some of the different styles that she has and this one I believe is called Junior and um, I just I, I love the idea that it's a recycled uh, billboard um, vinyl you know, she she purchased or somehow she got a hold of uh, some vinyl billboards and she's been cutting them up and recycling them uh, into these journal covers. And there's all kinds of sizes of it, which I like. And I really like the idea that they're recycled. Um, now this is, this is the junior and um, through uh, the collaboration that we did, the design team, Gina's design team did with Shannon, this is what I came up with. And I just collaged all different kinds of papers. Uh, of course, some of it is Gina Aaron's um, design type things on here. And that's okay because I, I really like this product. And is what I, you know, it's kind of based on, um, you know, an elastic system. And if I can pull them out. Here. You know, I may try and squeeze my uh, collage video that I did making this because you can't see what the vinyl looks like because I've already done it um, but you know it's it has adjustable elastics in there and um, I stuck all different kinds of different papers in here um, this is black uh, drawing paper uh, the inside of this, I believe, is uh, the smooth watercolor uh, paper. And I was putting these in the middle. And this one here is because I like to work with pastels. I put a couple of sheets of that in here. And I'm, I'm just really pleased how this is coming out. And... Um, it's, it's a beautiful idea, I think. And if you're looking, you know, I, I like to kind of support uh, our artists that we all learn from um, without buying a big name brand because you're paying big name prices for it. And, you know, I... Uh, there's mixed media paper in here. I even stuck a couple of postcards in here. Not that I'm going to decorate those on the outside, but the inside of it kind of gives me another little area to sketch. And, uh, you know, depending on what I'm doing, you know, that'll fit in my purse. It's a perfect size to go in your purse uh, to do some sketching. And so I just wanted to share this product with you because it's it's neat, and um, 
and I wouldn't recommend it if I didn't really like it. Um, but I will definitely uh, link uh, Shannon Green and also Gina Aaron's uh, Etsy shop below if you're interested in any of the products that you see here. Uh, you know, these were digital downloads uh, from Gina's Etsy store and she's got it at random words and all different kinds of fonts and um, colors. And, um, you know, the rest of it is just kind of collage with some some happy mail that I received or in the collaboration box to make this and um, it's I put it down with matte medium and um, if I can figure out how to link the making of it uh, without destroying my other video um, because I'm still not kind of um, I'm still learning the technical part of filming um, but I like the words that I put down. Laugh, be unique, explore, believe, dream, and inspire. Um, so I, I just wanted to do a little review on this and tell you all how much I liked it. And, um, you know, if you're interested, you know, I, I like the idea of supporting our fellow artists. And so that is my review, um, and I'll see if I could link uh, where, so you can actually see the raw cover. Um, it'll be sped up um, if I could figure out how to link it. But anyways, uh, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it. And um, if you like this, give me a thumbs up, please. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye now. Okay, I just wanted to add here that I had actually went over this with a little bit uh, some sandpaper, you know, just to rough it up a little bit. Um, but it wasn't much. I just took an emery board to it. <clears throat> Excuse me. And, you know, I wanted to add that um, this vinyl takes all kinds of different uh, mediums. You know, you can paint it. Uh, you could put gesso on it. Uh, it's, it's really a versatile product, and it's durable. It's... I was surprised how much I like this and um, you know when Shannon first came out with these I ordered uh, I forget what it's called but it's it's bigger than this junior one and I just haven't had a chance to mess around with it um, but I like it so uh, because you can you know put any kind of paper that you want in there and change it out when you want to. You could even buy pre-made notebooks and put in there, which is great. And I, I just wanted to come back on and um, tell you all that. And the things that I'm applying right now are things uh, that either came in Happy Mail or out of the collaboration box. And uh, they're stuck down really well. Um, the only thing that didn't stick very well are my homemade stickers, and that's be probably because the stick -em on it is a, a little old, so I need to pull them up and actually put some glue under them. Um, those were the little, you'll see them coming up in a second. And I, I really enjoyed this, this product. And I enjoyed making uh, this video, you know, for the collaboration that we did. Uh, I just wanted to share it with all of you uh, because I really think it's a comes in all kinds of sizes. Uh, and I'll link um, Shannon's video where she's talking about 
the different sizes. She even has one that holds pens or tools that you might use in artwork. Um, so I, I just wanted to say thank you again for watching and again I wouldn't review this unless I really liked it. These are the homemade stickers that I made and those are the ones that didn't want to stick very well. And I think the stick them is just old because they're actually uh, labels when you burn your own CDs and that's what that was. And there's a elastic that uh, I ended up taking out that middle one uh, because the elastic that you actually wrap around it to keep it closed I removed to decorate it and uh, I took it off because it would probably end up getting destroyed anyways trying to re-thread the elastic through the hole and um, this is nearly the end but I enjoyed doing this and I would recommend it to anybody uh, that is looking for something like this. Uh, it's, it's a really nice product and I want to just again say thank you for watching and until next time. Um, if you like this give me a thumbs up and I'll see you in group. These were some digital downloads from uh, Gina's Etsy shop. She scanned some of her uh, pores that she did. And those, again, are my stickers. I'm sorry, I thought it was almost done. Alrighty. I'll say bye for, for real now. Okay, bye-bye now.